Here we are very uh, honoured to be exhibiting the George Michael collection and to be selling it in London in March, uh, which is the spiritual home of young British artists uh, George Michael very much uh, admired and collected over the years. Um, it is a collection uh, which is uh, made with passion. Uh, it tells a unique dialogue between uh, a great British music artist and uh, his contemporaries, uh, visual contemporaries, because I didn't know until recently that George Michael was an incredible collector and we all discovered uh, that actually he had a passion and passion was art. Uh, and uh, what made him collect was the fact that he was a composer, he was a songwriter, um, he was an artist, he was a rebel, uh, he was a uh, uh, an incredible beacon for all of us, but uh, there's not the, the road between visual artists, like we call the painters or the sculptors or the video maker, and music artists like George Michael is very short. So for him, it was just a nice journey between writing songs and collecting art. For him, art was just another song. Um, it's more or less over 200 pieces of, uh, of, uh, of art, uh, of works of art, um, and it's uh, very spread. Uh, it goes from, it's not about value, in all honesty, it's about uh, in depth. So what he created, he created an episode of British art culture in 1990s and 2000. Uh, in terms of the value, it goes from anywhere between 400 pounds and 1 million pounds.